Yes. Okay. Right, so the reason we do a knife is that you can draw a knife almost with four lines. Okay? That's in a very, very basic sense. You can draw a, li li a knife with four lines. I'll go over that again with a darker colour. There, one, two, three, four. Okay? That's pretty simple, right? It's a little bit more to it than that. We can work into it. So I'll start again. Um, you just want to... With the pen, when you're drawing, you want to keep the line really, really light. So it's tempting to sort of do this kind of scratchy, feathery line. But you lose a lot of the clarity with that and a lot of the spontaneity with drawing. You might be wanting to not make a mistake at all and draw the line really slowly. And again, you lose a lot of the character of the line. All right. So what we're looking at here is a nice, crisp, fast line. If I don't get that quite as I want it, I can draw over it a couple of times and then I get the sweep of the blade, bring that down there. We start to fashion out a knife blade there. Think about the handle, how that goes round. And you can see that quite quickly we get a, the drawing of a knife. Let's get the blade in there. This little piece at the end that stops you cutting your fingers when you're, when you're chopping with it. All right, see how quick that is? To, to just draw a knife. All right, so what I want you guys doing when you go away and practice this is to just start filling a sheet of paper with sketches and knives without actually worrying about making a mistake. Because one of the reasons that people, when they're learning to draw, mess up is that they're really quite concerned about doing a bad drawing. Okay, they think it reflects badly on them if everyone sees them doing a bad drawing, a bad sketch. That's not the case at all. You mustn't be precious about your drawings at all. In fact, you need to be making a mistake to actually improve on that. Okay, so we're looking for that kind of speed, that kind of clarity of the line. And as the knife develops, as you get a bit more comfortable with the drawing, you need to practice a few times and warm up. Um, you can start to apply a little bit more detail, a little bit more styling. So the blade might come in there. We're going to look at perhaps putting a, an area there which will allow you to grip. Do that a little bit more slowly. Put the blade in. There may be a kind of a, a grip going in here. You can see the speed of this. Okay, and then we can work into it a little bit. Always before you apply the marker to your, to your drawing, just check. You might pick up one that's slightly running out. Just check it. And then you can just apply some uh, uh, tone on top of that. Okay, now I'm not colouring in. I'm rendering. I'm trying to create, a, the, I'm trying to work on a surface. So we render the surface. That's why it's called rendering. If I just try and make all of that grey, I'm just colouring in. That's not what we're doing at all. Okay, you want to get a sheen across the knife, it goes across the edges a little bit there, and then I can just work around that again, work around the edge, make that a little bit harder. In fact, I'm going to take a slightly thicker pen. Oops. There we are. Just cut out that shape in there. Like so. Okay, I'll just maybe keep that there to keep that sort of a bit more sharp. All right, simple stuff, yeah? Okay.